Isaacs here, welcome back to another Roblox video. Today we are playing Bloxburg once again. So this is the third day of me playing it. Um, so if you don't like Bloxburg, you're probably finding this very boring. So um, it would mean a lot if you comment down below some suggestions you want me to play and hopefully it will be more entertaining for you to watch my videos. So yeah, on Bloxburg today I'm going to be doing an update version of my house tour of my $120,000 house so I know that's a lot of money not really compared to everyone else's house uh, over a million dollar people's house and yes yeah, so let's start the tour outside and um, yeah don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for um, daily uploads um, so let's start the tour so outside we have loads of palm trees and some tiki torches and we have these really, these really nice fences, but they're they're a pain in the butt because they're very expensive, and all my money goes to waste on these. So I, I've been um, taking time to do everything else before the fences because they waste all my money. Um, so yeah, and we have this nice path which leads to my front door, which we'll enter later. And we have these nice like dirt outlines of the path, which don't really work. Over here we have the, some more palm trees and tiki torches and here we have the drive a very unique driveway i really like it and some of the dirt outlines and i'm apparently feeling down there why is this dude outside my house excuse me um bye okay we have this dry um garage door which we're gonna open later yeah so we have these let's start heading inside uh no no thanks he's trying to ask me to be his dad no thanks um, so we got this, these beautiful flowers and this outside uh, lamp that I never use. And yeah, so let's head inside now. We've got a doorbell, by the way, so it's really cool. We've got this the last door as our front door. And in here we have the first living room, but our only living room so far. But in the future we're going to build another one. So over there. And it's going to turn into a mansion. Woo! So we have this beautiful um, yellow carpet, which is awesome. We have these um, oval couches, which we have like everywhere. So I'm a bit addicted to them because they're so nice. And we've got these windows with curtains. And over here we have um, a bookshelf and a plant next to it. And we have, over here we have our TV and a mug and this dresser that is like the um, a shelf that holds the TV and yeah. So let's head into the garage now. Um, so we have a car, a 2500. Um, oh, we got bills to pay. Let's pay them quickly. Okay, um, this car is $25,000. It, um, I didn't, I never bought the first car that's for sale, which is 12, I uh, know, 18,000. I went straight to this car, so yeah, it's, I'm, I think it's worth it. So this, the garage has my bike over here, which I never use, and these really awesome paintings, which I'm gonna customize after. We've got a bookshelf, some more paintings everywhere, another shelf, and yeah, that's basically it. Oh yeah, this is my garage door. Let's open it and close it. And we've got another window there. Okay, let's close the door. And in here we have our kitchen and our dining room and our music room and yeah. So here's the kitchen. We have lots of food. Um, do we need food right now? Yes, we do. Let's quickly eat some tacos. Um, ooh, they're yummy. Okay, this is our kitchen. Um, we have a fruit bowl here. Um, we have this coffee machine which faces the window so you can look out the window when you're making breakfast. And right next to it is the toaster and the microwave and the fridge and the stove also we have this blue carpet right here and we've got some bar stools here and why is my back door open close that okay um over here we have the dining table and why is this door open here we have the dining table which has a hot dog just sitting there okay it has a room for six people so i don't know why i need that much space because i'm the only one that usually lives here except when there's room i have roommates here so yeah here we have some, another window which actually has some privacy shutters and also a curtain. So yeah, um, over here we have our music area. So we have a piano um, and a guitar which is awesome. And in here we have our first guest bedroom which is 
Um, it's really cozy. I, I'm kind of jealous of this room, but my room is awesome as well. So we have a TV, a fireplace, some, a poster, one of those lights, and that. This is a very awesome uh, color combination. It's black, white, green, and orange, or pink. I don't know what that is. Um, shelves on the wall, and we also have a bookshelf, uh, two beds, carpet, but the beds I can change it whoever how many people are staying here so if there's one I'll change it to one bed if there's two I, ch I keep it like this so yeah this is the guest bedroom one and over here we have the backdrop wall thingy next to it we have a coat hanger some of those shelves and a carpet here and a plant there and let's open the, 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 the guest bedroom so here we have the sink with a towel uh, this awesome backdrop which I love a toilet and some toilet paper and this window frame which has no glass people can just see through which is kind of awkward and we have a shower and a mat thingy okay let's head into my bedroom now the best room of the whole room at uh, whole house not really there's another room coming up that I love so much okay so when you head into my room um if you go on your right we have the wardrobe which has a really modern light which will turn on awesome doesn't really reflect that much light though which is disappointing but in a wardrobe you don't need that much light because it's a tiny wardrobe okay we have a coat hanger here a shelf of clothes there a mirror and a, a plant so let's turn off the light and oh i turned on it on okay let's turn it off oh okay okay let's head over to um tour the rest of my bedroom okay we're here we have a purple like a, a royal purple uh, carpet I wanted to do this color because it makes me look royal so um because it's in the master bedroom so yeah over here we have more of these awesome couches which I like I said I think I'm addicted to and here we have the fire pit and an awesome wall tv to go on top of the fire pit which is kind of dangerous to have fire under a tv so um here we have some windows um, a plant, a really unique um, bookshelf which looks like a tree. Um, yeah, and here we have my double bed. So yeah, okay. Um, we have some more windows here, and my awesome desk here, which has a, a pen holder and a mini plant, and I watch Netflix on it. Okay, yeah. So let's head on to my bathroom. It has a sink like normal, a toilet, and a shower, and a bath. And this really awesome light that actually reflects orange and red light instead of normal white light. And we have this uh, another um, window, and yeah, switch off the light so we can save um, uh, the power so our bills don't go like skyrocket. Okay, let's head over to my favorite place of this whole house. Um, here we have the hallway, which I'm going to be expanding into more like a mansion area there's going to be loads of guest bedrooms another living room another kitchen and all that jazz so let's turn on the light and we're going to head into the my favorite room which is the indoor pool <laughs> okay let's turn on the light so you can see um so in here we have this awesome tv a fireplace and um, a, a, a rug a um one of those light, loads of those lights again, and we've got a pillar and these massive windows where people can easily see you in the pool. So we have a diving board, a beach ball, some plants, and a poster up there. And we have this ladder so you can get out of the pool so you don't drown. That'll be not fun. Okay, let's head out of the indoor pool, pool even though we want to stay in here forever because it's the best place in the world. And let's head into the next guest bedroom, which has not been furnished because this house is still in um, progress. So let's turn on the light. I know this is very bland and it's really dark. I, ha I ran out of money when I was building this to get another light. So it's just got one light for now. But yeah, this could, this is going to be another be guest bedroom. So let's close the door and head um, onto the porch, which will be the last thing of our house. And yeah. By the way, at the end of the episode, I got some shout outs to give out, so please stay tuned. And let's open the door. Okay, when you go outside, you have got to turn, the, turn to the left and you have a uh, awesome treadmill. So you can exercise on that. Okay, guys, so over here we have um, a little um, 
sitting area where I sit out in the morning to drink my tea or coffee and toast. And we have a book here which I read, um, the Harry Potter. Yes, of course they are. And yeah, so that's basically my house. Let's do an overview. So it's not that big, but soon when I get more Robux, I'm going to buy the game pass, pass, uh, pass for expand plot thingy. And also um, uh, the um, good um, employee and the multi-story so we can upgrade it into a mansion. So yeah, um, thank you all for watching, guys. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And yes, let's do the shout-outs now. So our shout-out today is... So Lachlan Hoing, he's a new YouTuber um, on YouTube. He does sim videos and yeah, so I have a link to his channel um, in the description. And don't forget to subscribe to him, give him some love and yes, go check out his, his latest video where you can um, comment down below on his video to um, suggest some characters he, you want him to make on sims. So yeah. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications to get um, notifications when I upload, which is daily. And yes, yeah, so hopefully you enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! <laughs>